This is Matthew Francis with Go Engineer, and today I would like to talk to you about loading a unified library into your SOLIDWORKS PCB. Recently, the Altium website has created a web page which allows us to access some of their unified component libraries. This is very handy because we can quickly get a large library of components from the manufacturers without having to create our own libraries. So first, let's get started by opening up SOLIDWORKS PCB. I have a standard template already loaded. We are then going to pull up the Altium website and I want to go to design content and then to unified components right here. I am already logged in. They will ask you to create a small little login before downloading any of these library sets. We can sort by manufacturers as well as date, name, popularity or by the type of component itself. For this instance, let's use a memory chip, and I always like to sort by date to get the latest and greatest. Let's use this SSD flash microchip. You can see if I hover over any of these, it'll give me a brief description of what they are, as well as I can click on more details or download. So we'll go to the SSD micro flash and download. That brings me to the zip file. I will simply open this, and I want to copy this library file to anywhere on your hard drive. For me, I make it easy, and I copy this to my documents, SolidWorks, SolidWorks PCB, and library. So I simply drag and drop, and now that is there, the SSD flash. I will close these down and go back into SolidWorks PCB. We can then pull up our libraries, either through the Libraries tab on the side, or we can go to View and Libraries here. We then want to click on our libraries and pull up the available libraries. Uh, I am on the installed tab and we want to click on install from file. It, it automatically opens up to my libraries and I will simply scroll down to SSD and click on open. This now integrated the SSD microchips into our libraries and so I can simply close the available libraries and then from the pull down select SSD flash. You can see we now have a large list of components, all from the manufacturer, um, available to, to us through PCB. So I can simply just take one of these files and drag and drop it onto my schematic and move it around wherever I need to. You can do this both in the schematic side as well as the routing side. Again, I'll click on libraries. Let's go pick a new chip and I will simply drag and drop this on here. So fairly quickly and simply, I can get a nice large library of different components from the Altium website and quickly start routing and using SOLIDWORKS PCB. Thank you for watching this Go Engineer video. This is Matthew Francis. Have a good day. Bye-bye.